Hello, my name is Komlade City Bank. Today I want to talk to you about the prudence concept. In running businesses, we make profits sometimes, other times we make losses. It's sometimes very inevitable when losses come. Losses could be as a result of so many factors. Now the prudence concept means taking caution when making judgments in conditions of uncertainty. What does this mean? This means that in situations where you are not certain of the outcome, it is very prudent for you to take caution rather than always anticipating profits in conditions of uncertainty it is better for you to anticipate losses rather so that whatever measures you need to put in place in order to curtail these losses you are able to do so let me give you an example instead of making projections for reduction in feed prices in the future it is better for you to make projections for increase in the price of feed instead of making projections for a reduction in the prices of things or the materials that you will need to run your business rather make projections for increase in prices in the future so that when you get into the future and you have already made your allocations but the prices are reduced inflation is reduced and all other environmental conditions necessary for your business is favorable then you are at a gain rather than at a loss this is called the prudence concept so you, you rather make some conscious effort and put it at the back of your mind that some things can go wrong and then you rather work towards safeguarding all the other things that could go wrong and also appreciating everything that you need to deduct or everything that that comes together to form your profit so that you do not overstate them or understate them especially for the liabilities and expenses it's very important because you need to put together everything that comes together to form your expenses as a business person other than that you may be stating your profit meanwhile there are a lot of expenses that you have not deducted and so you may be holding a lot of money in your hands but all of this money is not actually profit there are bits and pieces of expenses that you have still not deducted so it is very important to appreciate the full value of your liabilities and expenses so that you can make a full appreciation so that you can get a full appreciation of, of all these then you can be able to get your full value of profits that you are making in the business or whatever business you find yourself guess what the world is too complex to allow 100% of your efforts to lead to 100% of your outcome <laughs> it's 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 never possible that you put in 100% you get 100% out of it no you may do everything right but in the middle you may have some outbreak of diseases that would kill about maybe two percent of your beds but you did everything right so you arrange your life in such a way that even when you lose a little here or a little there or you miss some investment goals here and there you you are not totally wiped out of the business but you still remain in the business because you have some leverage and you keep on fighting until the odds are in your favor and then you push and you win and you make some um, cash for yourself and you make some profit for yourself if you like this video and you want to see more of this video or similar videos kindly share your comments what you what you think about the video share like and subscribe i would like to say a very big thank you for watching the video and i would like you to subscribe please subscribe to the channel subscribe and watch and share and comment and i mean till we meet again <laughs> until we meet again it is a bye bye for now thank you